from a nap. Did you just get up from a nap? Yeah, you did. Hello. Just got up from a nap. I think we're gonna go ahead outside and try and get the barrels finished to string the lights up. So I'm gonna try and hopefully get the lights done today. Are you ready? Hi, beauty. You ready? Oh, hello. Hello. Look at those beautiful eyes. Oh, put all these posts. We did this one already. It's got the concrete, which is, I think, yeah, hard now. So we just gotta do. One over there, two over there. Finish, finish up the posts, the concrete, and then Josh is gonna string the lights. He's working over there of connecting the lights to the post. There you go, whoa, it's so windy. in the wind? Are you blowing in the wind? You can watch some cars from Sesame Street, huh? You got your water. All right, baby. You, you play. Now it's your break. Gonna make that one lean a little bit. Up a little bit. Lean back up too far. Pretty good. And then I'm just gonna hang the lights. Hopefully that looks out. 
do you like your watermelon? It's yummy. This is the wire he's using. He just got the thin 1 16th rope, wire rope, and then a bunch of other little things. Good, now it's straight across. Yeah, it seems higher too than originally. Yeah. Looks good. So now you gotta do one from that post back up to there. This is actually made for hanging string lights. It's made or for those. hanging wire. Yeah. Not necessarily string. Darn wire won't cut. How you doing over there, baby? All right, light time. <laughs> yeah. Smell that. <gasps> what is that? How's that going? Better? You don't think so? Um, I don't know. It's hard to tell. It definitely wasn't missing. Which way is the wind blowing? Can you tell? It's kind of just circular. Yeah. Had this thing pick up, but I think more from God, this looks horrible though, so I can't imagine. Well, it's it. also dusty right now, so is that one? It's gonna get dirty. I'm trying this this time, we did the rust oleum paint, so I can't imagine it's much different though. Do you think it's like thinner? Like, because you thought that the paint on for this one is a lot I mean, thicker. I can control the thickness a lot easier than the we need to move you over though, because yeah, it's smelly. I might try and put you in. This is the one we're using with, for the one chair in the spray gun. And it was difficult. All right, Brave. Better than the spray gun. Yeah. yeah way I'll see though, yeah, how it how it dries because this one is like, yeah, you just see the after the dust, it still has like a bumpy, a yeah, it was bumpy just so like thick. texture. The paint was just super thick. So it's almost bubbly. Yeah, that's what I mean, it looks I mean, like. Also, the spray was not consistent either. Yeah. And I missed a bunch of spots. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'll just sand that one down again. It's probably just spray over with the. With this one, see how this one does dry though. Doesn't look like it'll do better. Let's see. All right, a fun tip if you have paint on your hands, well, they got some off already. Paint on your hands is to use a magic eraser. The paint comes off so fast. We are doing our tile today. You can see it, they're almost done. That looks so good. 
here's how the floor turned out. Looks so good. Hey, we have our table still coming and chairs come tomorrow. We have our little barbecue section set up. Just need all the ficuses across that wall to get some privacy. That wall is super short. Yeah. We still have all the me plants and everything to do. But fire pit area is pretty much done. We have cactuses that are gonna go in between all these along with other green bushes. We said ficuses all across there. And then I think we're gonna do some trellises with vines up there. And then we're hopefully gonna get a big, huge eight foot stock tank that I'm gonna paint, make it look super cool for over there with some lounging, um, just like pool loungers over here on this side with some really good, with some really cool um, cactus and plants back there via by that window. So hopefully I'll do another one that shows kind of the actual finished product.